AI image generation just got an upgrade. HiDream now runs natively in Comfy UI. Four text encoders, GGUF models, and even lower VRAM GPUs can create stunning visuals. Let me show you how it's done. Before we dive into the setup, it's important to understand the different versions of the HiDream model, because choosing the right one can dramatically impact your image quality, speed, and VRAM usage. HiDream comes in three official variants, full, dev, and fast. Let's start with HiDream Full. This version delivers the highest possible image quality with rich detail and complex textures, but it's also the most resource intensive, requiring around 20 gigabytes of VRAM to run smoothly. Next, we have HiDream Dev. This is the sweet spot for most users. It offers an excellent balance between quality and speed, and runs well on setups with at least 16 gigabytes of VRAM. Finally, there's HiDream Fast. This model is designed for speed and efficiency. It runs with as little as 12 gigabytes of VRAM, making it perfect for quick drafts, testing prompts, or running on cheaper cloud GPUs. That's still quite a bit of VRAM, but luckily there are GGF models, lighter, compressed versions that use less memory while keeping good images image quality. These are perfect if you have limited GPU power or want to save on cloud costs. Later, we'll explore both the standard dev model and its GGUF counterpart to see how they compare. For now, we'll focus on running the HiDream Dev FP8 model because it offers a great balance between image quality and performance. Let's start by covering the system requirements you'll need to get it up and running in Comfy UI. First things first, you need to have Comfy UI installed. Whether you're setting it up locally or using a cloud GPU like RunPod, we've got you covered with two detailed YouTube tutorials for both options. Now, let's jump into a loaded HiDream workflow in Comfy UI, where we'll zoom in to show exactly which files you need to get started. You'll find all the download links and resources in the description below. And for those who want to take their time or need extra details, we also have a comprehensive written tutorial on our website complete with every link, workflow downloads, and step-by-step -step instructions. Let's begin by focusing on the Load Diffusion Model node in the HiDream workflow, where you'll find the HiDream Dev FP8 model loaded. This model is essential and should be downloaded and placed into the Diffusion Models folder inside your Comfy UI Models directory. Next, HiDream requires four specialized text encoders to deliver its exceptional understanding of prompts. These four encoders work together to improve how the model interprets your text inputs, which is a big reason for its impressive image quality and prompt adherence. Make sure to download all four encoders and place them inside the text encoders folder in your Comfy UI models directory. Lastly, HiDream uses a specific variational autoencoder, or VAE, to transform the model's latent outputs into the final images you see. This VAE file needs to be saved in the VAE folder, also within the Comfy UI models directory. With all these files correctly placed, your setup will be ready to generate high quality images with high dream. Before running your workflow, it's important to verify that the key settings are correct for the HiDream Dev FP8 model. Inside the workflow, you'll find an official section dedicated to these configurations. For example, the model sampling SD3 node should have the shift value set to 6.0, which is crucial for this model version. The case sampler node typically uses 28 steps with a CFG scale of 1.0. Double checking these settings ensures your workflow runs smoothly and produces the best possible results. With your workflow fully set up, it's time to put the HiDream dev model to the test. We'll use a carefully crafted high impact example prompt to instantly showcase its artistic quality, the level of detail it can render, and how well it captures both style and sensuality. When you're ready, simply click run in Comfy UI and watch the magic happen. Amazing, right? You just generated your first HiDream image natively inside Comfy UI. By the way, this render took about 20 seconds on an RTX 4090 with 24 gigabytes of VRAM. Not everyone has access to a 24 gigabyte GPU like the RTX 4090, and that's totally fine. HiDream also comes in GGUF versions, which are optimized to use significantly less VRAM. These models come in different quantization levels, from highly compressed Q2 versions all the way up to full precision B. F16. As a general rule, just pick the highest quality GGUF model that comfortably fits your GPU's VRAM. For example, if you've got 16GB of VRAM, the Q16 
6 version at around 14.7 gigs is a great choice that balances performance and image quality. When you download your chosen GGUF model file, be sure to place it into the Diffusion Models folder inside your comfy UI models directory, just like with the other models. Let's start by dragging the HiDream GGUF workflow file into Comfy UI. When it loads, you'll notice that instead of a load diffusion model node, this workflow uses something called UNet Loader GGUF. If that node appears missing, no worries. You just need to install the Comfy UI GGUF extension. To do that, open Comfy UI, click the Manager button in the top right, then open Custom Node Manager. Search for Comfy UI GGUF by the Developer City 96 and click Install. Once that's done, restart Comfy UI and the node should appear correctly. Once everything is set up, select your downloaded model, enter your prompt, set the image dimensions, and then click Run to generate your first image. Again, for every link and resource we mention, we like to refer you to our full written tutorial on our website for a detailed step-by-step -step walkthrough. Woo, talk about a divine masterpiece. That angelic glow and those curves are pure next-level magic. Now that both the HiDream Dev FP8 and GGUF models are ready, let's put them to the test. We focused on key areas like anatomy, detail, style, lighting, composition, and technical challenges. Take your time to see how each model performs across different aspects. To be honest, the GGUF version doesn't lose any quality at all. Just watch and decide for yourself. Head over to our website. I've set up a full gallery where you can explore every image side by side. No rushing. In this video, I'm just gonna scroll through the categories so you can get a quick feel for it. First up, anatomy and proportions. We're looking at human and animal forms plus complex poses to see how well the models handle realism and balance. Next, detail handling. This zooms in on precision, micro details, macro scenes, and intricate materials like lace, velvet, or chrome. Then, text rendering. Always a tough one. We check how cleanly the models reproduce stylized and simple text elements. After that, style versatility. Think art deco, pop art, sketches, retro photography. You'll see how adaptable the model is across different aesthetics. Following that is composition and concepts. This is where we test storytelling, abstract ideas, and complex scene layouts. And finally, technical challenges. Lighting, reflections, transparency, tricky camera angles. All the stuff that pushes rendering to its limits. It. High Dream delivers stunning cinematic results with impressive control and speed, all inside an easy, seamless, comfy UI setup. Minor quirks like occasional extra fingers or small anatomy slips happen, but don't take away from the overall polished, production-ready quality. Ready to see the difference for yourself? Try High Dream now on Next Diffusion for the fastest, smoothest image generation experience. No setup, just stunning results. Whether you're creating art, testing ideas, or pushing boundaries, it's all just a few clicks away. Thanks for watching. Hope you get High Dream rolling soon, and I'll catch you in the next one.